All right, guys, we're back at Hexit. We are outside the volcano, just like I told you we'd conquer it. Well, we're here. I've dug a little tunnel to the base of it so I can come in and out as I need to. Uh, not, not that I'll have to run away or, or, or anything like that, because, you know, we're, we're decked out with good armor, we got weaponry, we got everything we need. And, uh, yeah, yeah, we're good. I'm not scared. Uh, no, no, I'm not scared. Let's just, let's just go in there and, uh, and, uh, you know, uh, yeah, yeah, let's, <sighs> ah, shit, all right, here we go. <clears throat> dun, dun, dun. Okay, um, got my manual hook so we can kick butt and take, oh, you know what I just realized? Oh yeah, before we get too hasty, before we get too hasty, uh, first, uh, let me health up here. Oh, the rain is kind of annoying now that, uh, now that I think about it, but more importantly, okay, I've got some coal, I haven't got sticks, it's dark in there, and, uh, we need, we need wood and coal. I think coal should be just... Well, there. Uh -huh. And there. So we're not hurting for coal, but we're going to have to fetch some sticks. And uh, make sure we could light that place up. Because let me tell you, there are enough mobs in there. You do not want anything extra. There's enough spawners in there that any uh, naturally spawning mobs are just going to be too much of a pain in the arse. And I don't want to deal with them. So, uh... We'll light it up as we go. No sense in heading that direction. Ooh, here we go. Lots of coal. Lots of coal. We should be able. To... There we go. We should be able to make quite a few torches with this. Uh, hopefully, it'll be enough. I'm pretty sure it will be. I plan on uh, getting. I don't know. At least a full stack. Uh, maybe more than that. And uh, I want to be real, real liberal with how I do my torch placements in here. Uh, tons and tons of mobs without any extras ruining my day. So let's just keep gathering some coal, the never-ending quest in Minecraft. Uh, no, probably don't want to bow it out of the ground. There we are. There we are. Coal. Oh, co oh hello. Coal right there. Of course, we're going to be... Ro oh, no, no lava. Oh, there's lava. Okay. Well, we'll leave that to a do its thing and we'll keep harvesting here. I don't really care about the iron I see around here. Um, we are all about looting and ruining this dungeon so that's what we're gonna stick to. That's the game plan and we're moving forward like champs. Okay, uh, a little bit of gold. I'll take it. Not that I need it but I'll take it. And uh, what does that give us? 38? Okay, we need sticks. Do I have Oh, Lord. Okay, I don't know if I have an axe, uh, but we're going to find out. Let's, uh, first, let's duck in here and out of the way. I don't want to have to deal with uh, mobs spawning and all that rigmarole while I'm doing this. So let's just do that, and let's just do that, and I think that's good. Uh this bag is awesome this bag combined with uh, these big backpacks are fantastic for inventory management uh, or just hoarding depending on your point of view uh, each each bag has a slot here you see all these slots what is that that looks like oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine slots or so uh, and then they hold a backpack or whatever you want in there backpack makes the best use out use out of it uh, so we'll put a backpack there in our primary inventory and uh, we'll click out of the bag move over to the backpack and right click and here's the contents of the backpack so uh, tons tons ooh there we go that's what I'm looking for tons and tons of inventory space pretty much never have to worry about running out of places to put things ever ever again and, and speaking of which, I think that one has has some stuff in it, but I think as early as this big cyan backpack, I think may be empty. Yeah, so this is empty. All right. 
So that means, uh, just because of the way I've organized my backpacks up in here, my inventory, uh, I put full ones on the left and uh, diminish on the right. So these two are going to have things in it. That means all these are free inventory I haven't used yet. Fantastic. I love it. I love it. Uh, anyway, this isn't getting the job done. So let's exit out of there. Uh, break our way back out into the woolly wide world. And see about cutting trees down in the dark with monsters and stuff. Okay, let's do this thing. All we got to do get a couple uh, tree capitators installed in Hexit, so it should make it a bit easier. But doink! Look at that. Boy, if we can't make some uh, torches out of this, we've got some serious issues. Wood, 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 wood. Wood for days. Awesome efficiency, by the way, on this axe. Uh, it's a loot from somewhere. Uh, I've gone through so many dungeons and looted so many chests. There's no telling. And, you know, <laughs> it's not like it tells you uh, in a name tag or something where it's come from. Uh, although that would be nice if any of you modders out there are uh, listening. That might be something to consider. I'd love to know where some of this stuff comes from. Uh, but, just a side thought. Okay, that ought to be enough. Let's get back over to... Whoop! There it is, I heard it. I heard it! Can we get to it in time? Probably... Oop! Oh! Hello, lightning! Speaking of lightning, just the other day I was playing... I got nailed. Ooh, see, it's coming after me. I'm out of here. I got nailed by, uh... Gosh, I don't know, like two lightning strikes? in a single uh, single storm it was nuts it was nuts uh, it didn't kill me um, I really thought it would have uh, but I survived because that's how I roll okay here we are now probably didn't need to do that oh by the way these guys here these dwarfs immune to fire so don't uh, don't think you can kill them by knocking them into lava as you can see you just kind of they dance in it they they kind of hang out they chillax if you will sort of a sort of a uh, fiery discotheque maybe mm, or or maybe not you know whatever whatever uh, let's get our stuff square I don't need that um, let's uh, dump some things in the big back Paku maybe not that big back Paku like I said, left is full, heading to the right, they're empty. Okay, um, I'm going to keep that. Uh, electric stuff, ooh, that could be handy. Ooh, that could be handy. That we don't need, that we don't need, that we don't need. Chain boots, no thank you. Diamond spear with smite, nope, nope. Um, Got to keep that bow because mine's getting low. Food we're keeping, don't need that, don't need that, 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 that. One of these days I'm going to find out what all these are for. I know you can make the uh, staffs out of these essences. I've never done it. Um, lots of good things to do without making staffs. Uh, but who knows, maybe making staffs is one of them. I know the electric staff is useful. Uh, I've tried the wind staff, I think it was. Uh, it blew tornadoes around. Not all that great. Hey, a heart. I can increase my hearts if I make a heart canister, add this to it. It'll actually uh, start doubling up on my hearts down there. You know, that might be something worth doing. Uh, I'm going to keep an eye out for more of those hearts. Okay, uh, don't need saplings, don't need that here. What else don't we need? That we don't need. Everything else is golden. Let's, uh, alright, so let's make some torches. Mm, what? Barricade? No. Uh, let's just do that. Like I said, I want lots of torches. Sticks? Pink sticks? That's all right. We'll uh, we'll take it. I don't know how many torches I'll be able to make with 38 coal, but well, that's how many torches we're going to be able to make with 38 coal. All right, let's uh, fix our inventory again. Oh, my backpack's already out. Good deal. And uh, keep the torches. Ditch the wood. I like that pink wood. I got to add that to my house somehow. Sort of an accent piece, if you will. That I want there. This I want there. This, I want that. Inventory management people, so good. I always like to know where my shite is. 
in case I need it. And I think that's it. We're good. Inventory's clear. We can start racking up on loot. Let me stick the backpack away. Donk. And look at there. Alright. Here we go. I am going to stick with the leggy bow because, well... Oh yeah, here we go. Lots and lots of light. One thing I found last time I went through a volcano dungeon, uh, if that's the proper name for this, is a lot of the spawners, uh, especially on these upper levels, are out towards the wall, uh, the, the exterior wall. Kind of a pain in the butt because you'll be running along, uh, not recognize that you're skipping a bunch of them, and then you start wondering, why the hell do I have so many mobs around? So, I kind of go this direction until I see a spawner in the distance. You see how dark it is back here? Then they'll put them behind these pillars. Dude, what the heck? What is that? Is he holding something? Well, we're going to find out soon enough. Oh, it's a bannerman! Hey, cool. I like your banner, bro. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Oh. 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 Yeah. Yeah, how do you like that? How do you like that? We got ourselves a little Batman action going on here. I'm Batman. Oh. I'm still Batman. And I'm Batman. And I'm Batman. Batman. <laughs> Batman? See? Love that. Uh, my last video, uh, although I realize now you probably couldn't even hear me talk about it too much, but uh, this is the manual hook. Excellent, excellent tool for just this kind of emergency. Reel it in. And we're rolling. Don't need that. Lots of experience. Nope. Kadonky donk. Hello there. I'm not going to hit him in the fire because then I can't chase him and he'll just creep up on me and slay me anyway. So the heck with that. Do a little torch action. We like the light. Ooh, diamonds. Oh, you know what? I, I just don't need the diamonds, to be honest. <laughs> I mean, this is Hexit after all. So let's do that, and then let's do this. Reel myself up in. Kind of a bungee jump going on here. Hello, laddies. That's a nice beard you got there. Ooh. Ooh. I gotta tell you, I found two of these bows so far in I don't know how many hours of playing Hexit. And look at that. It just rocks. I've been able to hit up to three, I think, three enemies at a time. Now, it won't do 31 damage all on one en enemy. But oh, I gotta quit hitting that. I forget I'm hanging by my hanging by my hook, and I gotta scroll over to it to release it. But, uh... Yeah, those Legia bows, man, uh, they're killer. They're killer. They're completely, uh, watch out for holes. They're completely decked out with, with uh, enchantments galore. Nothing we need there. And uh, they do a number on, oh, yeah, that's right. I don't want to kill you when you're sitting down. I would actually feel bad, guys. Come on. Challenge. Oh, who's, oh, geez. Come on, man. Yeah, let's just beat you with my bow. Eat it! Eat it, dwarf! I shall toss you! Is that is that still politically incorrect to all the dwarfs in the world? I'm, I'm just kidding. Um, what do we got here? Moving along. A little bit of light. And you'll notice I'm going down. Um, we started up here, or thereabouts, uh, and we've... Is this 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 uh, nether? Oh god, dang it! This netherrack fortress. Excuse me, boys. Or fortress is not a fortress. Just this netherrack platform just spirals and spirals and spirals all the way down. Lots and lots of surface area. 
to uh, get yourself in a, a wee spot of trouble, if you will. All right, let's take care of business here. Oh, he's a healer. Go away. Uh, yeah, I don't want to... That's what I didn't want to do. He'll just either fall in the lava and heal his buddies down there and not die. Or he'll land on the platform below, heal his buddies and not die. Either way, he's healing his buddies and I don't particularly care for that. Okay, where are we at? Oop, more, 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 more. That's right, guys. Eat it. Eat it! Oh, beating him with chicken. Don't beat my meat! If you don't beat your meat, how can you have any pudding? If you don't eat your meat, you can't have any pudding! I don't really need melons. More diamond. Let's just take care of these dudes right quick. Whoop! Wait, wait. Oh, dang. Somebody's got a knockback or something going on. You, sir. Okay. Moving right along. Yeah, we're not doing too bad. Uh, there's a bunch of them. What? Katow. Oh, oh, hello. Hello, boys. And that is how you strategically use the manual hook. I love it. Uh, let's see. Any mini, miny, mo, catch a dwarf by his toe. If he hollers, make him pay with his life. <laughs> Suck it, dwarf. Suck it, dwarf. Dwarven scum. I actually felt bad for that last one. I gotta, I gotta admit. Ow. I guess I... I could have unreeled myself, maybe. I don't remember what the command is for that. Maybe like, maybe like, control shift or something. I don't know. Either way, Dunzoed. Did I check that? Yeah, I did. Continuing along. There's one. There's two. We're rocking it, guys. We are rocking it. A little light never hurt anybody. Hoo-da! Well, I mean, unless you're a creeper wanting to spawn or something like that. A little light. A little light. Spawner. Oh, oh, not good. You know what? Doesn't matter. I, I just, I just thought about. It. Oh. <laughs> Uh, I kept trying to avoid the lava, and uh, you see my effect particleizations around me. That is thanks to my dandy dandy uh, hexical armor here. Strength, resistance, and fire resistance too. So, yeah, you know, like, uh, huh, I can do it too, guys. Yeah, not alone. Scared yet? That would be kind of a, that would be kind of... Who the hell is dying? Couldn't have been a dwarf. They don't get affected by water. I heard that. Or uh, by lava. I heard that though. Carrying on. Carrying on. Wasn't used to taking that fall damage there a second ago. Uh, I've been wearing my cloud boots so much and for so long. That uh, you start taking it for granted. And perhaps one might ought not to take that for granted. One might incur damage if one takes that for granted. Is that a dwarf behind there? That sure is. Hello, Bobbin. Did you got where where'd he go? He dead. He dead, Jim. Jim, he's dead. Uh, that wasn't quite Bones, I think that was Sean Connery. Got a little confused there. Sort of a mix between Bones and Sean Connery. Ooh. Feel the power of my sword! I don't know what's with the little feathers on their heads. Um, seems a bit odd. <laughs> seems a bit odd. Uh, yeah, whatever. Ah, oh, jeez. Can't waste too much time taking these guys out. They just keep spawning. Okay, 
Let's check some loot. That's a, that is one thing I found. A lot of uh oh slowed. Oh Lord. What are you doing? Dwarf Grenadier. Am I slowed? What's going on? No? Okay. Through the head. Hey, while we're up here, let's try to uh, figure out this. Um. Okay. Uh, it beats me. I'm sure there's probably a way to uh, lower yourself down without taking that fall damage. Did you see me bounce? What the heck? I don't got jump boost or anything. What an odd thing. Gimme, gimme, gimme. More and more torches. You know, I did think about, uh, just because I like this place so much and it's huge and it's covered, uh, I did think about at one point turning this into a dwelling. Perhaps a home away from home or a primary residence maybe? I don't know. Uh, but what stopped me uh, is this netherrack all this netherrack uh, I'm a little superstitious with netherrack I, I don't know if it's uh, somehow detrimental like like I don't know like microwaves or something if it gives you cancer in Minecraft but uh, either way I don't like it and what happened Oh no, do we have an issue? Okay. I think... I think we've got an issue. Can I break this? Oh, there we go. Game kind of lagged behind a little bit. Uh, yeah, so... We are uh, back in full swing. Let me check these chests. Bread. Bread. The mainstay of every first Minecraftian. We are getting close to the bottom. I just want to... I just want to take out these spawners real quick. I don't want to have to worry about them later. Oh! No, not into the lava. Not that it matters too terribly much, but I don't know how deep it is. And, uh... And uh, it would just generally be rude. Oh, okay, there's the bottom. Dun! Dun 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 dun! And... He's dead. Cool beans. Gravy boat. What do we got? What do we got? Let's light this area up. And I think... We are dang near the bottom, peoples. He was harvesting that. Did you see that? He was like picking at it. That was kind of cool. I now regret putting sword through his little fat dwarven belly. Okay. Where are we at? Dwarves. <laughs> Dwarf on the water. Dwarfing in the lava. Da -da -da, I don't know the words, dude. Smoke on the water or something like that. Ooh, hey! Hidden chest with gunpowder and torches. That was cool. I have never found a hidden chest like that before. Uh, uh, well, <laughs> in here, in one of these before. I found plenty of hidden chests, just didn't realize these uh, volcano dungeons. Dang. I don't know why I'm getting so close to these. To, uh, to, to destroy these spawners. I don't need to. I believe about that close is far enough. What do you got in there? See, this is an awful lot of work for uh, for steak. You know, for hamburger, essentially. Let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of that. I can follow you in there, you know. How crazy would that be? You're a dwarf just minding your own business and some burning guy comes running out of the dark with a sword screaming. Bleah! Yeah, I would need bridges. Oop. These guys, although, 
are probably a bit tougher than me. Oh, dang. What the hell? Uh, I think we're here. We are. Oh, what the deuce? Okay. Uh, <laughs> I didn't even read what he had, but, uh, he was special. <laughs> he, 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 oh, come on. There's another, uh, uh, dude, dude. I'm trying to do my thing over here. Jeez. Why you got to get up all up in my business? See, and then I have to do that to you guys. And nobody, oh, God, you, no wonder you were sitting there. You just did not give a heck. Yeah, I said heck. I know that's generally not what follows that. Vines, beanstalk, a book. Eh, I'll take books. I like books. I'm a reader. What can I say? Okay. There we go. There we go. Oh, let's not get stuck in there. I'll take fire essence. Again, I'm collecting this stuff. I don't even know what it's for, to be honest. I mean, like I said, I, I know it's for staffs and whatnot, but I'm just not one to make staffs. Are we seriously not at the bottom yet? Come on. I may not need to destroy all these spawners, but I hate surprises. Oh, jeez, Louise. Feel the power of my Legia? Ah, uh, let's go look at more food. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, so, um, what the hell? There? Okay, here we go. This is the right direction. Jeez. Oops. There we go. Plus, you'll notice that you can see, uh, you can see the partal, part, uh, part, partal, partal, partimus, part, parkour, particle effects from uh, bedrock. So that tells you, you know, we're we're at a decent depth down here. Oh, oh, here it is. Here it is. Ladies and gentle germs. Here is the main event, the dungeon of dungeons. At least for this uh, this volcano. That holds the boss. God dang it. We'll go in there and defeat him shortly. Oh, jeez. Come on. But for right now, I think that's going to do it for this video. We've made it down to the bottom of it. We've taken care of all the dwarven spawners. We're going to let those guys... Be oh, hello. <laughs> hello. I spoke too soon. <laughs> I spoke too soon. Oh my god. Uh. Uh. I'm Batman? <laughs> eh? I want to be Batman? I'm enough of a Batman. Okay. Yeah, see? That mist you get down at Bedrock and it hinders your vision. It doesn't really seem to matter how much you put torches down. It doesn't seem to matter much of anything your vision just goes and you get surprised surprise so let's at least try to put some candles down candles that's a mighty big candle you got there sir why thank you I'm just happy to see you <laughs> perhaps a, a, a touch inappropriate okay that's it we're there all right, guys, I'll see you next time. It's been fun. Whoopin' ass.